In 2020, the world was shocked by the untimely death of Prince Azim of Brunei, who passed away at just 38. Known for his opulent lifestyle and celebrity connections, Prince Azim's life seemed like a fairy tale. But beneath the surface of luxury and fame lay a complex and tragic story. What made his life so captivating yet so sorrowful? Let's uncover the intriguing and lesser-known aspects of Prince Azim's extraordinary life. Prince Azim was born in 1982 into the Bruneian royal family, inheriting a staggering fortune of nearly $5 billion. His father, Sultan Hassan al-Bolkiah, is renowned for his extravagant tastes, including a massive collection of luxury cars and the world's largest residential palace, Istana Nurul Iman. Azim's own life was equally spectacular. He was a prominent figure in celebrity circles, hosting lavish parties and mingling with stars like Michael Jackson and Naomi Campbell. His 25th birthday celebration was legendary, featuring $25,000 gift sets and an extravagant array of luxury items. In Hollywood, Prince Azim made a mark with his production company, Daryl Prince Productions, producing acclaimed films such as You Are Not You and The Happy Prince. Despite the glamour and success, Prince Azim faced significant personal challenges. He struggled with bipolar disorder, a mental health condition characterized by severe mood swings and periods of depression. This aspect of his life was largely kept out of the public eye, overshadowed by his high-profile social life and charitable efforts. Azim's personal life was also complicated by the conservative values of his family's regime. The Sultan of Brunei's reintroduction of Sharia law which includes severe penalties for offenses such as homosexuality, stood in stark contrast to Azim's support for LGBTQ rights. He was known for his friendships with LGBTQ figures like Caitlyn Jenner, making his public and private worlds difficult to reconcile. Prince Azim's health issues became increasingly prominent in early 2020. Reports indicate that he faced a serious medical condition that led to his passing. The details surrounding his illness and subsequent death were private, but his passing was met with a deep sense of loss. His funeral was a somber event, attended only by close family members. The public reaction to his death highlighted the contrast between his glamorous public image and the private struggles he faced. Despite his wealth and high-profile lifestyle, Prince Azim's life ended in tragedy, shedding light on the personal battles that often remain hidden behind a facade of luxury. Prince Azim's life is a poignant reminder of the complexities that lie beneath the surface of fame and fortune. His contributions to film and his lavish social life are well remembered, but his personal struggles and the challenges he faced also form an important part of his legacy. Azim's story invites us to reflect on the pressures of living under public scrutiny and the hidden difficulties that many individuals endure. His life, marked by both grandeur and personal turmoil, serves as a reminder that even those who seem to have it all can face profound challenges. In remembering Prince Azim, we gain insight into the human side of celebrity and wealth. His life, though filled with luxury and high-profile connections, also reveals the deeper struggles that can accompany a life in the spotlight. His legacy continues to resonate, offering a deeper understanding of the complexities faced by those living in the public eye. Thank you for exploring the life of Prince Azim of Brunei with us. Share your thoughts in the comments below, and be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more compelling stories. See you next time on Luxury Freaks.